YouTubers get it your boy Small Pound back with another video on your head top. All right, so right now we're gonna check out a clip. It's like a um, a five minute clip from uh, what is it? Today with Hoda and Jenna. All right, um, not sure where this is from. Never heard of this thing before this uh show before pretty sure they're gonna copyright me because you know that's what people like to do because i'm gonna just let it play pretty much for the most part see what they were talking about beyonce recently wrapped up a renaissance world tour in kansas city and talk about a success it was the highest grossing tour by a female mm -hmm. artist in yeah, history wowza donna <laughs> caught up with two dancers who shared the stage with queen b and they're using their talent to spread an important message yes. hey, Donna. hi ladies okay so laurent and larry bourgeois this is how you know you've elevated past a certain point as a dancer, too. Or late twins. They have become famous in their own right. And now it they're heading out on a different kind of before. tour, using their moves and their story to help others. They're among the most famous twins in the world. Laurent and Larry Bourgeois, better known as late twins, have undeniably got the moves. Most recently, world dancing dance. alongside Beyonce on her Renaissance World Tour. I caught up with the identical twins at the Gramercy Theater in New York City. Ah. You two just finished the Renaissance tour. How are you feeling? I miss her. Yeah, already. I, I call her monster, Beyonce. But Why? She, it's because she's a monster. She do one thing and it works. For 56 shows in 39 cities, on stage, they were Beyonce's left and right. He's the I'm still stick by what I said. I ain't like a lot of the outfits that they were wearing. I'm just saying, they were low key, unnecessary. I already know Beyonce's got a big presentation to go with and everything, but you know. Left arm and the right arm. That's it. It's, it's, it's just how it is. It is what it is. You the left one. No, the right one, Larry. I was the right. You forget break my soul? Break my soul. I'm in the right side. And as I witnessed, the backup dancers still bicker like brothers. The dancing Facts. duo grew up in Paris. Enough. The youngest of nine, they took an early interest in dance. Nine? Nine pick me, nine kids. That's that's uh kids in Jamaican. Nine. And even with no formal training, oh, they the found family on the major. Back. Uh, uh, uh. Look who they done brought to the major leagues: Playmo and Rubik's. Success. In 2010, they Just went viral for this them. video from the World of Dance tour in San Diego. A classic. Soon after, they were dancing for the likes of Missy Elliott and Megan Trainer. When did they dance for Missy? The dancers, models, and designers won the World of Dance TV show in 2017. The winner of World of Dance. And in time, their relationship with Beyonce has blossomed and even consider the Carters family. Laurent, you posted a photo of the two of you with Beyonce and Blue Ivy. That's probably an understatement because he said, um, Beyonce was the reason that he learned English, I believe. Something to that effect in an interview. You said the the only people I trust in life. Yes. Why? There's nobody That's I big. can trust more than Jay-Z, Beyonce, and Blue Ivy in my life, like the whole family. Famously protecting B on stage like this wardrobe malfunction in Detroit. When I'm with Beyonce on stage, I make sure that everything is good because I want her to to do her best. We are to help. They were also there alongside Blue Ivy as she joined her mom center stage. I think she, a 12 years old make me she laugh because she's stage. so honest. We have so much fun. Now the twins are harnessing the power. First of all, we have to address something here. How do celebrity kids grow so fast? That's, that's what I want to know. And if somebody has the answer, please drop it down below in the comment of dance into helping students across the country. Workshops. Partnering with several organizations, they're embarking on the Rise for Mental Health Tour. 42% of students report feeling so depressed, it's difficult to function. It's a statistic lay twins are hoping to change by drawing from their own experience. See, for the people that's depressed, you need to think it's best if you can find an outlet like this right here. They're creating an, an outlet through dance, but I mean, it just doesn't have to be dance. So even if you yourself, you're watching this and you're feeling depressed, like get up, um, go outside, take a walk, probably try to meet some people, 
uh, go to the gym, things, things that are, or even just start working out. I mean, you don't need a gym to work out, but something to keep your mind off of what's uh, keeping you down, right? It could just be your situation, right? Find ways to make it up out of your situation. But then the most important is put things into action. So if you list 10, if you list something at the top, list 10 different ways that you can possibly get there and start moving towards those goals. Like manifest manifestation without action is, is almost nothing. All right. Yes. He did go through things I would never go through. I did go through things that he probably still don't know. Not like it's easy to talk about. It's just that yeah. sometimes you would tell me something and I'm like, I can't believe you did that. I can't believe you didn't tell me this. I can't believe you did go through this and I didn't know where I was. On the tour, sessions begin with a classroom portion, then a dance workshop led by the twins. How do you help these kids with mental health through movement? When we speak to those kids, we let them share issues that they have personally that they never said to anybody. So if, if, if the whole thing with criminals fall off and everything was stemming from them not being around and maybe not doing battles and stuff like that, then this is the inverse. Like you can clearly see where their time is going. This is like directly giving back to, um, to communities that, that need it. Like I said, kids and stuff fighting depression. They're firsthand, firsthandedly, that's, is that a word? Directly, you know, trying to combat the issue on their own. To our year, and we don't share this to the room. And we let them express it their feelings through, their through bodies, wherever, wherever the whatever body goes. Whatever they're feeling. Music, conversation, and dance can universally heal. Yeah. Feeling inspired, we finished our time with dance. Yeah, with these shoes. Oh, let's go. But with a little twist. So it's a this or that dance off, okay? This or that. Who is the troublemaker? I think I know who it is. Tell me that. You happy? Okay, who is the biggest I risk taker? I agree with that. Who is the most creative? No, Larry. You, can, <laughs> you cannot say. Okay, I cannot say, but who got more ideas? Who, so who created ideas? the human chair? Oh, oh no, that was both of us. That's both, That's of, both us. of you? Every queen has her throne, and for Beyonce... I never saw them do... I've seen them do that move, but I've never seen this. This move was one of the hardest things that I've seen... I think I saw I think I saw them do it twice. One maybe on World of Dance and then another one um at at another performance, but I was definitely fired away to execute it. The that. twins human chair. This seat may be reserved, but that, hey, I fire. tried. <laughs> Okay, cool. they said only Ooh. Beyonce can cool. touch the, the human, the human chair. That makes sense. That makes sense. I don't want to wow. change that. Yeah. Yeah, it was really cool. Well, um, that's pretty much the end of it. But doing this video because I know I missed a upload on Thursday. It wasn't feel Wednesday. Wasn't feeling that well. But we back. All right. Next week I have um I guess we could call it a surprise, but I'll give you a hint at what it is. It's a change up of um the look. So we're definitely gonna have a new look on the channel. We're going to I'll just let y'all see it, right? All right. Boom. With that being said, it's your boy Small Pound signing out. Like, share, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notifications. All right. That's it. Let's go. Peace. Don't forget to live your passion.